Hi, welcome to Greeklish Outdoors. Today I'm going to do a um, another camp at my uh, base camp. The only difference is it's going to be pretty damn cold tonight. The skies may be blue, but there uh, definitely has been snow in the mountains. I'm not sure if you can see far up there because the cloud is quite low at the minute. But all the mountains over there are covered in snow. And it's going to get down pretty low tonight. So it's minus two right now, but feels like minus five because of the wind chill. And tonight it says it's going to get down as far as minus six. So again, if you add two or three degrees, degrees on with a wind chill, then we're looking about minus nine tonight, which is pretty chilly, but gives me a chance to test out my winter gear. Now I haven't got a sub-zero rated sleeping bag um, so I'm going to have to layer up a little bit. So I've got my sheepskin, I have got a wool blanket and um, I've got an extra pad as well which I got. So not only have I got my Climate Static V, I've also got a foam pad. So hopefully that should insulate me enough on the ground to stay warm. I will also be having a fire throughout the um, the afternoon and the evening. Um, I've got some nice food to cook up, lots to do, tent to set up, wood to collect. Um, I hope you have a good video. So I've put the bigger of the two vestibules on the opposite side of the tent. Now that's because most of the time the wind is coming in this direction. So if I want to cook in the vestibule, it'll give me a little bit more shelter on that side. So today I'm out in the Quichua, is that how you pronounce it? Quichua, two seconds easy, tent by uh, Decathlon. It is their fresh and black series. So it has got a blackout inside so the sun doesn't come in and yet there's enough ventilation so you don't get too much condensation inside. Now it's a freestanding tent. I will probably do a review on this um, at a later date. But I brought this out in, instead of the Nature Hike Cloud at One as it's a bit sturdier, it's a bit more wind resistant. If it does snow, it will handle it better, I, I believe. So that's home for tonight. Using the old silky pocket boy. Let's see if we can get through this. It's a bit damp, probably now. <laughs> Thank <laughs> you. 
for the pocket boy, which is a fairly small saw, did pretty well there. It's quite dry inside, so that'll be really good for later. Right, well as usual, I forgot something. And that was, I have no spatula um, or fork to eat with. All I've got is um, an American MRE plastic spoon, which will obviously melt if I'm using it for cooking. So I've got a piece of uh, green wood. Uh, this is European horn beam, and I will attempt to carve out a little spatula or fork with it.
I think I might have to call time on the uh, the log torch. I do not know what it is. I've put fat wood in there. I've put everything and it will not light. And the log <coughs> is dry. My eye. What can I do? I've tried fat wood. I've put alcohol in it. I've used fire lighters in there. And the thing still will not light like it should do. Right, I started making the log torch around about 12 o'clock. It's now 10 past two. And I have to admit, uh, the torch failed. I don't know why. Even the regular fire took some going today and the wood is dry. So I'm tired now, I'm hungry and I'm pretty cold. So time for some lunch. Choose a room. Excuse me. Mm. I love this uh, seeded bread. What's your favourite bread? No, don't tell me. Such a dull question. It doesn't deserve an answer.
Hey guys, it's uh, it's time for a beer. Oh, uh, this is Gordon Brown uh, for my Prime Minister. I'm uh, I'm here in Greece, uh, pissing about. I think it's time for me uh, to get a quick fix. Uh, tis shite, but it's cold and wet, so I'll drink it. Time for a quick beer. Cheers, everyone. May you reach heaven ten minutes before the devil knows you're dead, as they say in. Uh, I don't know where they say it. Fuck it. So with all the kit I've got with me today, I should be warm enough in there tonight, I hope. If not, um, I'll probably die. Right, it's getting chilly. It's about minus two, minus three at the minute. I've lit the fire. And tonight I'm gonna to make a stew. I've got some cabbage, carrots, mushroom, sweet potato, a few herbs and spices, and a beer, which I might put a bit of beer in it, and probably some of the leftover sausages from earlier on as well. And I think I'm gonna need it. So in here, there's uh, garlic, uh, parsley, ginger, pepper, some uh, beef bouillon, and some paprika. bit of beer in it. Right. Let's stick that beside the fire and hopefully it'll reduce down a bit. Cheers everyone.
Jesus Christ. Well, the fire's going. It's nicely warming up my front, as you can see. It's pretty cold. In fact, I can tell you roughly what temperature it is right now. It is minus three. Ah. Oh. The fire is now going properly. It was very smoky before. I think the wood must have been a little bit damp. But this is why I come out here. Peace, quiet, fantastic view of the mountains. Nature's television and some hot food on the way. Let's see how this stew's going. Let's see how this tastes. I'm looking forward to this. You know what? Not bad at all. Not bad at all. And it's warm. Which is great. Right, so the stew was very nice. Warmed up a little bit. Now I'm heating up some water for my little hot water bottle. And uh, going to fill my bottle up with some water as well, some hot water, so I can maybe have a nice warm drink when I'm in the tent in a few minutes. But it is freezing. It says minus three, feels like minus six. It definitely feels like minus six. Um, I'm so glad I've got the fire and, and I'm looking forward to getting in the tent as soon as that water boils. Right, I'm in the tent. Um, it's pretty cold outside. Minus four. Feels like minus seven. And it's only gonna get colder. Um, obviously this is not cold for you people in Russia or uh, North America, but this is Greece after all, so it is pretty cool. So I'm going to have a hot drink, which I made in here. I uh, put my hot water bottle in my sleeping bag. I have got my regular winter sleeping bag, summer sleeping bag inside that. I've got my Climate Static V with the foam mat underneath that. Um, I've got a wool blanket, which is on my lap at the minute, and my sheepskin, which is what I'm sat on. Um, so hopefully 
it should keep me warm through the night. Uh, but now I'm gonna relax for a little bit, um, maybe watch a couple of things on my uh, on my tablet, and I'll get back to you in a bit. Morning, everyone. Well, it was a freezing cold night, but I wasn't cold. My uh, sleeping system kept me pretty toasty in the night. So, let's get up and pack up. Mm -hmm. 